Katze! <laughs> You're being cheeky. You used to work in Aldi, is he? Well, I think I really want it. Idiot! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Don't they know I'm just a girl? I feel sick, I feel sick, I feel sick, sick, sick. I'm nervous. I feel sick. I feel weird. Weird, weird. Oh, I'm buying some chocolate. Morning. Happy Monday. <laughs> I always feel like such a fucking bell in saying that. I like a Monday. It's fresh, it's new. I. Right, I've got six vlogs left to edit. This ends this week. It ends this week, okay? It ends this week. I, this week, I have, I'm going, I'm going out with my mum and my grandma. Oh, oh, so sweet. And, or maybe my auntie as well. And I, I have a house viewing. And me and Jake have got a pasta making class on Sunday. So yeah, those are our highlights for this week. Another one done. Got some parcels. My hair's gone too curly. It's like ringlets. I hate that. I just feel ugly and gross today. Um, yeah, I don't know what this is. This, oh, Windsor Smith. Sick. They asked if they could send me some shoes. I think it's an Australian shoe brand. Ooh. And then some new ones that have come out. They asked me. He was like, we'd love to send you some shoes. And obviously I picked the ones that weren't even out yet. So I've had to wait until Feb. They are the shoes of a woman. Those are woman's shoes. But I've wanted some really nice black boots for ages. Got a nice heel. Just feel good. They have got a tiny little square toe. Kind of. Beautiful. Then I've got a package from Boots, which is very mysterious because it's so light. 17 cosmetics. Oh, so it's for their second birthday. Oh, they've got a new new brown pen and a, and a lip oil as well. Nice. We love, we love a lip oil. Another one. Another one. That was supposed to be DJ Khaled. Don't know if that came across. Look at the state of me. Kata. Kata! <laughs> it's time for cake and noodles. I need to get rid of this cake soon. It's reaching the end of its life. I will finish it. I will absolutely finish it. I've really enjoyed it, you know. The last time I got a cake, I got it for my phone cases being made for my skinny dip ones. And I got um chocolate one. It wasn't actually that good, you know. I don't remember it being that good. Maybe it was. But I got red velvet this time and I've really, I've just really enjoyed it. I thought it was fantastic. So, yeah. Should I be eating noodles and cake at three o'clock? No, but I'm going to. I like trying different things in these noodles. So I've done mozzarella today and it's so stringy. They're just gorgeous. They're my favourite. It's probably unnecessary calories added in the cheese, but I don't care. This is so annoying. <laughs> There's only one slice left. I mean, there were two big slices, but I can't keep stretching it out. It's it's getting dry now. It's still beautiful, but it's getting dry. It's got to be finished in the next day. Another one. Getting very weak at this point. Hi. I've just been... Well, I edited all day, but I've just been answering some questions. I did a little um, question box on Instagram and... It was quite nice actually, it was a nice little break because being on your phone, staring at your phone all day for a start is awful. Not even just your phone, two phones and a laptop screen. It's just like square eye city. And then having to watch your own face is just, uh, it's, it's irritating. And you're looking at yourself and you're thinking, oh, why do I talk like that? Like, why do I move like that? That side of my face is awful. Just having to look at it, it's fucking pain in itself. And then having to relive, I know it's all my fault, having to relive the past, like, 15 weeks of my life because I've not kept up with vlogs. And there's some things I don't want to watch again. <sighs> anyway, yeah, it's just a really... <sighs> I don't know what the right word is. But it's quite a drab job editing up so many vlogs in one day. 
I really, really need to learn my lesson one day. But, you know, I've got three up today. I thought I could have done all six that I needed to do. Wait, it's more than six. I thought I could have finished them all today, but do you know what? That was draining. So, yeah. You know what? I've done a lot. I've done a lot. It's fine. I'll continue tomorrow, as long as it's done before the end of the week. Uh, yeah, I did an Instagram question box, but that was nice. It was nice. I feel like I can let my feelings out there. People ask me questions I wouldn't even think about. And then I'm like, actually, this is what I think. So yeah, it's quite fun. I like making the stories look artsy as well. Putting nice pictures and stuff. I had fun with my story today. I did a little like, uh, just a reminder, spring starts a month tomorrow. And then... 11 days after that the clocks go forward and then from then on the sun will set from half seven in the evening and yeah i just and i made it for all like spring stories and it was just nice to look at aesthetic pretty uh, and it's just a nice feeling because obviously a lot of people have seasonal depression me included and it used to be like that but yeah i just want the sun back so yeah got shit done even if I did just sit in bed all day I was working hard in bed all day and I washed my gym set so I'd go to the gym in the morning <sighs> but that's me done for tonight I want to watch something with Jake good morning my face tan's gone really nice I've used my u-turn my Jamie Jane and Eve um so nice I need to keep it up I don't really keep face tan up I just look like all kinds of colors throughout the week I think I just need to spray it every couple of days but then you need to make sure you moisturise as well because otherwise you start to get your fucking speckles on your forehead not good right I'm going to the gym getting it out the way because I've not got any heatless curls in this morning I had them in all day yesterday and I didn't even need them in so it's just, I, I waste that I waste them a lot oh my god I'm not seeing that car um, editing all day again and then me and Jake are going to view in a house today. I forgot about that. I didn't tell you, did I? So the second house that we're viewing. We've seen a couple. We we had one book that we wanted to see. We really like that one. And we've not even seen it yet, but that one's been sold. There's another one we really like that's sold. You just gotta be fucking quick. Uh, but we, I think we've got our mortgage in principle now, so I think we can. You're being cheeky. You're actually being cheeky. Right, come on now, get through. Um... Yeah, you're fucking welcome. <sighs> yeah, our mortgage in principle now, so we can put in an offer if we see one. But this one that we're going to see, and I'm not completely struck on. It's all right. It's all right. We'll see. We'll see. Hi. Not the best session from me. Uh, I don't know if it's just because I'm tired. I felt quite weak. Maybe it's because I've been going in the evenings after my tea. Anyway, I'm going to Aldi now. I'm gonna go and get some of the protein pops that me and Jake rim. Because they really like fill you up nicely after your tea. And they're not they're not hideous, they are enjoyable. Uh they really do fill you up. Like I, sometimes I can't even finish the full pot of the cheesecake ones. Uh so that's good because I keep just wanting popcorn in the evenings. So yeah, I need to get back into that habit. Maybe a popcorn at the weekend. <sighs> and I'm going to drop in some stuff off at the charity shop and then we are editing. Although we've just, me and Jacob just found out that that house we're going to see is next to a factory. So probably no point in going seeing it. But we'll go anyway. They do some nice pastas at Aldi. I like this really curly one. And then they've got bucatini. Not a lot of places have bucatini. I got all the best ones and they've got a new, new, the best ones are for me, these cheesecake ones. Um, they've got a new vanilla one, new flavour, exciting. Just got all sorted caramel, chocolate and vanilla. Very nice. They have self-checkouts in there, which is crazy for Aldi. And they're really good as well, like the you can scan very fast so i was doing she came over she was like oh you're scanning too fast i was like sorry I used to work at aldi you see <laughs> i can't help it it just comes out. every time i go in aldi it comes out one way or another sorry I used to work in aldi you see <laughs> i need to die 
I just get really nervous when I drop things off at the charity shop because I just think, what if, what if they think that what I've brought into a bag of shit and they're like, why should you brought that in? But one man's trash is another man's treasure. If they would like to bid it, they certainly can, but someone may find one of those items and think, this is what I've been looking for all my life. All my life. Anyway, I'm starving. Okay, here we go. This could be our house. No, it won't be. Um, we actually really liked it. I'm walking around this fucking house with all hair dye on my forehead like an idiot. Like I've been hit. Yeah, we, we liked it. We did like it. We liked a lot about it. Weird. Um, there was a few things like, well, we wrote a list of pros and cons and the pros list is so much bigger than the cons list, but some of the cons are just like the, the bathroom was a bit of a funny layout. It's a little bit wedged in, but I mean, it's our first house and I'd rather go for area than size. Personally, I just love where I live. So I know that we're gonna get a little bit less for our money. I know it's gonna be smaller for a first house, but don't mind. Um, so we will get stuff like that. But I had a really nice, like, sizable garden. Um, love the kitchen. It doesn't need much doing to it. The house. And I've always said that, yes, I've got a big bedroom right now, but I'm gonna get hit by a ton of bricks when I move out because I'm never gonna be able to afford a bedroom that big. The bedroom was as big as my bedroom, which is nice. Um, and the only thing is where would I work from because there's a loft room, but I need a square backdrop. My backdrop's always square and the loft is obviously like that. There is one other room I could work in, which I think I would have to because it's square. I don't know that it just that's the main thing for me working out where I'm gonna work from but I went in not think we weren't even gonna see it when we found out it was near a factory it was like should we even go and see it I, well Jake said that I was like we'll just go and see it anyway but the factory shut I think it's nine to five anyway and it, it wasn't as in your face as you thought it would be hmm. interesting <laughs> Looks good. Morning. I don't know why I sounded bright and kind of half happy when I said that. Um, I got up at, I woke up at I think half three. Yeah, half three in the morning. I was boiling and then I just couldn't get back to sleep and then I was thinking about that house the whole time. Couldn't get back to sleep until I think half seven this morning and then got up probably about 40 minutes later so yes very tired could not sleep i tried everything to sleep could not sleep i was trying to do like put the meditation on my phone that usually gets me to sleep i've not used it in a while but i thought you know what, i'll even dig that out because i'm trying so hard and even that didn't work but it's helped me to decide though because i think well i think i really want it um something and i like supreme when i'm worried about it selling out i just fucking get it i just fucking get it even if i've got a slide down so with a house and they go so fast i'm just like let's just put it over let's just put it over we need to go and see it one more time because we need to um take jake's dad and see if we can do anything with the the bathroom just a little bit shoehorned in we wanted to see if we could do anything about the layout in there uh, but it's something I could live with it's not a deal breaker we've said so just waiting to hear back I'm going for a facial now 
my second micro needling session i feel really groggy and grumpy though because i didn't get any sleep i went back to bed until half 11 which i really shouldn't have done but i could barely sleep anyway it was i literally only got like 30 minutes because my mum was clashing around um I just had my eggs on toast. I'm obsessed with eggs on toast at the minute, but it's good because apparently they're a great source of protein eggs. But I think it's okay to have a twirl after my breakfast for some reason. I think because I've been to the gym, what, like four times? Three, two times now. I can eat whatever the fuck I want. Look, I am grumpy and I want a twirl. I always have to have dessert after any savoury. It's really bad habits or really bad habit oh god puddles everywhere and i got uggs on they had a parking spot thank fucking god because if they didn't i always park in this like um spot in northern quarter where it's cheap and it's easy but it's like is there a spot it usually is i got one anyway and um i went to the machine to pay it took like fucking a good four minutes to get my card to actually work and then i realized the whole time someone had left a ticket in there for someone to use that lasted till like three o'clock, but I just didn't notice it until I paid. Idiot. Oh. Hello, are you okay? Hello, is that Suzanne? Suzanne Koenig? <laughs> Jenna? Yeah. <laughs> I'm bugging you in. Come up the stairs, I'll meet you at the top. Thank you. So funny. She, she's changed buildings recently, so she said they've not changed my name on the puzzle yet, so just press it for season. Suzanne, Suzanne. Jenna? Suzanne? Hi! <laughs> <laughs> the way you said it, with such conviction, I was like, um, it's not Suzanne. <laughs> no, this is so cute. It this is Kate's new place. So, no, don't get out of the way. <laughs> oh, it's so <laughs> This is my skin before. We're cranking it up today, aren't we? So funny, because after I did so yours, was, I then did mine on the same intensity. You were like a tomato. Your skin must just be really resilient. Like, I was like really? red, red. Put me on like, level 10. Imagine dripping in blood. <laughs> Put me on level 10. Yeah, I do draw blood quite a bit, so, but I am obviously older than you, so my thin skin will be thinner. It could be thin, perhaps. Uh. <laughs> yeah, that's a bit. <laughs> she just put Still it on, on and I could not stop <laughs> laughing, but like in an awkward way. <laughs> Tickles, but it fucking hurts. <laughs> yeah, this is what it more felt like the first time I had my needle in like many, many years ago. Holy shit, like my eyes are watering. How have I drawn blood? Yeah, we have a teeny bit, yeah. <laughs> See, this is why I was like, after I did it on you, I then did mine that same night, and I was like bright red. <laughs> so I wonder if maybe last time it didn't work, like the needle didn't come through. Honestly, really what, it didn't hurt weird. at all last time. It and we didn't get this reaction last time either. <laughs> oh no, I'm scared now. Have some redness tomorrow, you'll probably find that then when you wash your face, it'll get redder. So it turns out that I don't think it was, I don't think the needles were coming out properly of the machine, the micro needling machine last time. So she put it on like a high level, and I was just like, oh yeah, it's fine that. I just can't feel a thing. I didn't even go red. And then, yeah, obviously it wasn't really working. And then she's put it on this time and it was working. I was like, whoa! Yeah, it was um, quite prickly today. Still very bearable, but um, yeah, a lot worse than last time. But I like that though. I like to know that it's working, it's doing its thing. And yeah, hopefully I'll have gorgeous skin for the rest of my life. I'm starting getting my needling. Was gonna go to the gym tonight, but I can't go to the gym as part of the aftercare. What a shame, what a shame. It's all right though, because it ties in, because today is the last day of the, it's the last slice of cake, so it's the last day of cake. For tea, I'm having a heart attack on a plate. I've actually, it looks like someone's chewed it up and spat it out. Rocket on it? Are you mad? Nothing can make that look better. I've never had cheese on a jacket potato, believe it or not, in my life, so I went ham. Mum said you can't have butter on it as well, but I did that as well. <laughs> 
It's happening again. What? It's happening again. This ends tonight. <laughs> Uh, another one. I think that's... Please tell me it's four left now. Okay, that's enough for today. I think I better go to sleep. My eyes hurt. There's how many vlogs left? Three vlogs left. That's... We're getting there. We're getting there. I... I'm just so worried about tomorrow. I'm going to go... We're going to unit with Jake's... No, my mum. Jake's dad. Um... Just to see what they think and if they think there's anything that we've missed. Because obviously, they're sh just stupid kids. Um, Yeah, I'm just worried that they're going to point out a load of shit that, like, isn't good about it. And then it's not going to be as good as I thought after all. I don't, I think I've just got one of those personalities where I just think everything's amazing. But I don't, know because I'm the most, I'm so evil sometimes i'm always like that shit that shit that shit so i don't know why i'm like this i think i just see a lot of potential in things so even if it's a shit house i see what it could be and i think that's why i'm so like yes 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 i don't know i don't know maybe i'm just not sensible i don't think i am sometimes <laughs> just see something and I want it but uh, we'll see we'll see if it happens great I hope it's for the best if it doesn't happen there'll be something else but I think I really would like it to happen but we'll see I could be setting myself up for a lot of upset probably am Hi, good morning. How are we? My skin feels good. It was, um, it felt like sunburn yesterday. But no, it feels fine now. Cleansed before bed, put a nice moisturiser on. I did use my fake tan spray. I think that's fine though, because it's very gentle. It's just like CBD. I mean, it's probably not the best thing to do, but I just, I needed a bit of tan. Uh, it's half ten now. I've just been sat here trying to bribe Jake all morning sending him pictures of supreme items that I would have in my home and I was like and my skateboards could go in the living room and yours could go in the kitchen <laughs> and he's like right we'll just see what happens I said please I'll pay the extra money that you don't want to pay because it is a little bit expensive for what it is but no I don't think it is I think it's great I love it and we've established that my mum, she can't help me. I'm sorry, mum. She can't help me with the vintage. The pictures don't come out good enough. I'm too anal for it. I can't. So, Chloe, you better do a good job. No, she will. She will. This is why I picked Chloe, because she's good at stuff. Lincoln, heck. It's got building. The clothes rack I ordered. I didn't know it had building. Don't they know I'm just a girl? May I just say, I am an incredible young woman. No hesitation, just straight Bob the Builder mentality. Look at that. Craftsmanship. Wow. I have tidied everything and organised, but Chloe's not coming now. <laughs> I think she just had too much to do, but I've got a banging headache anyway, and I'm still in my pyjamas. So, I'm fine with that. I'd rather just sit down. My head hurts so much. I don't know why my head's hurting so much. I think I've been thinking too much. I don't think I normally think this much. I've, I've had a headache since yesterday evening. And I thought it would be gone by now. So, I've caved and taken some proceeds well. And another one. Time to set off to this viewing. I feel nervous. I tried to put in my heatless curler for like two hours. Just to make myself look presentable, obviously. It's not fucking worked, has it? It's worked a little bit. It'll do. It's not great, but... Jesus, Jenna. Do you know what? It's not bad. Look more presentable than I did before. It'll do. It'll do. God. I just hope. hope everyone says they like it. There's no problems with it. And... 
they say, oh, Jenna, take this house. My mum's trying to make one that she saw on uh, first dates last night. No, dinner date. Someone <laughs> did a chicken in a can, so she's trying to do it. What's the benefit? Is it that it's not slimy on the bottom? Yeah, it's got a chew in it. I hope it works for you, mate. I feel sick. I feel sick. I feel sick. I feel sick. sick, sick. I'm nervous. This is what my mother's asked me to do. This is an actual task. Oh, oh. Oh, turn it to one side. Oh my God. It's like it's giving... Oh, oh, ooh. It's literally blubber mom. Ooh, this is rank. Oh God, it's... Oh, oh it's a girl. It's a girl. Leave it, leave it. It's a girl. Leave it. Did you not want the beer to go everywhere? No, that's fine. I don't want the beer anywhere. Is it a girl? It's a girl. It's a boy. You're going to be a dad. That is vile! <laughs> Should we put a flash on? Oh my god! Hey, Mom, it's like a horror film! Hey. <laughs> oh, no! No! Right, this is it now. I'm gonna go to Jake's now. And I've gotta, because we've not actually properly spoke. Like, he came with his dad, I went with my mum, and then we both just drove off. We didn't get a chance to me and Jake actually speak. I want it. I want it. I want to put in an offer on it. <sighs> yeah. So I'll see what he says. Oh, it's ended. Did you hear that? That horn. Da -da 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 yeah, no, I want it. I really hope that he wants it too. Really hope he's going to say, Big fat J, let's put in a big fat offer. Maybe not that big. Here goes nothing. I'm going to have a nervy bee. I'm going to have a nervy bee. Got a look ugly. We're putting an offer. We're putting an offer. We're putting an offer. I feel sick. I feel weird. I feel... I feel like... Is it silly? We've only seen two houses. I wasn't thinking that before, but now I'm thinking. Is it stupid? It's the second house we've seen. Don't tell Jake I said that. Just, yeah. I wonder what she'll say. I've just tried the new flavour of the Aldi protein pot, the uh, cheesecakey ones. Vanilla. It's nice, it is nice, but it's not better than the salted caramel one. Um, they are so good for weight loss, these though. You literally get halfway through and they're so filling. I feel like I can't go on. That is thick. I she is it. thick. Morning. Um, she's replied to our offer, but I can't see the response. I can't see the response on the website. But I don't think it's good because she texted me to let me know, but she didn't tell me on the text. So to me, that says that they've not accepted it. So, yeah, we'll see. Jesus Christ. They've accepted a half of So weird that. So weird that I could have a house. We could have a house. Weird. I still am not getting my hopes up because anything could happen. But hopefully we can get it locked in today. But I mean, it's looking good. It's looking good. Oh, I feel a bit sick and sad now. I mean, this marks the potentially marks the end of my life at home, and that's like your childhood pretty much over. This is why I said. This is why I said when Jake was like, "I want to move out. I want to move out. I want to move out." I was like, "You'll never get these years back. You'll never in your life again." Spend this much time with your family and be this close to your family. You never live at home. Well, you might live at home again, but and now it's potentially over for me. <laughs> Does not make me really sad? I know I can go come back home whenever, and I probably won't. But <sighs> gosh, I'm getting old. I'm scared. I feel sick. I feel weird. I feel pleased. 
I didn't think they'd accept it. Well, we did offer a counter offer, but then we said that was our maximum that we'd offer, so then they just accepted what we'd put in, but I didn't think they'd say yeah. <sighs> so weird. You'll be sicky sick. You'll be sicky sick in my stomach. I've got no signal at the minute. I think the signal is just broke around here for today. I don't know why it keeps going on and off. So I'm on a dog walk and I can't even contact anyone. You know when you've got news and you're just like, I mean, Jake knows, my mum knows, Jake's mum and dad know, but I don't know. I, I, I'd like to be able to discuss this information. I mean, it's good though, because I can think about, I can be with my thoughts on this dog walk, but yeah. So weird because, I don't know, it's just weird. One of my best friends lives practically around the corner from this house as well, so she doesn't even know. She doesn't even know, I don't think, that we've been looking for a house. So I'll just be telling her. <laughs> Hi! Just to let you know, I bought a house and we're moving him around the corner from you. <laughs> oh, weird, weird. Supreme season has started again as well for spring, summer, so probably need to rein that in. Do you know what? I didn't buy anything really in autumn, winter. I think it was just the last spring, summer that went a bit mad, but um, I'm going to have to get something. I've got the boxes in grey and Grey and red because they're nice and I love the boxes, especially since they've changed the way they are. They used to be like have tight thread around the thighs and they'd even be thigh tight on my thighs and they're made for men. Um, but they changed it now so it's stretchy so they fit really nice. So I got two packs of them and then I got this. Now, it is a toolbox but I thought I could use it for other things. It's way bigger than we thought it would be though. It's pretty cool. I'm just debating whether to keep it or not because it's huge. I mean, it's probably a good thing that it's huge. Um, <laughs> I thought it was a lot smaller, so my idea was to put like table things in it. Obviously not using it as a real toolbox, but am I insane? Celebration eggs. <laughs> probably one of the most serious days of phone calls in my life. And this is what I've done. That's enough for one day. That is enough for one day. I think we sorted everything though that we can for this weekend. But obviously anything to do with houses like solicitors and etc. are not in on the weekend. So we'll just have to leave it for now. Um, I'm a little bit scared in case obviously they've accepted the offer. But who's to say someone won't come and view it this weekend and say we'll offer you the full price that you wanted. All we're counting on is loyalty here and I'm very nervous. I need some popcorn and chocolate buttons to soothe my soul. And then we'll keep watching. We're watching, is it called The Fall? The uh, Netflix program with Chris, the Mr. Christian Grey man in it. Yeah, he's really creepy in that. He's pretty gross in there. Uh, not got, definitely got not, not got the Christian Grey appeal. But yeah, it's getting a little bit interesting. We're just struggling to find anything interesting at all at the minute. So we're going to go with it. We're just going with it. We'll see what happens. It might get really good. I appreciate the opportunity. Good to see you. Nice to see you. Relax. It's so beautiful and sunshiny today. But then... Oh. Skinny Dip sent me their new AirPods Max cases. Very, very cute. With a little red bow on the top on my white pair. Sorry, my dad is destroying something downstairs, I think. Um, yeah. Don't really condone cases on AirPods Max because I just think they're so beautiful as they are. But as, as we can see, I already put a load of red shit on my other ones, so I'm actually a fraud. But it's fine. It's fine because we've got two pairs. So I can have one pair with these on to protect them and one pair on their own. I need to tidy up this hell once again. Once again. I really need to downsize all this if I'm going to move out. I'm going to have to do a massive giveaway because there's no way I can take this much stuff. There's just no way. I won't have the room, so... Yeah. I've narrowed my clothes down from about four or five of these boxes to one. That's all the stuff I'm keeping. And to be honest, I could sell some of it, but I'm so, so attached to some of it. But that's an improvement and all this needs to be sold. That's enough work in the loft for today. Well, I pretty much... I don't know. Yeah, I think I've... Done 
all of what needs to be done in there anyway. Uh, Chloe can't come round and help me because Chloe's drank too much and Chloe's been sick, but it's fine because, well, I've got time to do it myself today, so let's just see how much stuff I can get on Vinted. I hate this job. I've got a nice shiny new setup though, so this is my rail and then can I have my bed in the background and I think it'll look nice. I just want my Vinted to look nice. Fucking hell. I never wear these pyjamas. I never wear them. But now I'm thinking, do I want to keep them? The sisters and seekers, I never fucking wear them. Jenna, listen to yourself. But I'm feeling them now, and I just went to search how much they are, and they're still on the website, and it says bestseller. So now I'm like, bestseller? I've got a bestseller right in front of me. Do I want to get rid of them? Because the top's so boxy, it makes me look fat, and they, but they feel really nice. They feel really nice. But I no, I need to listen to myself. I'd love to keep the shorts, but then what's the point? No, I don't think I'll wear them. This is, the, this is why I've got so much stuff, because I just can't say bye. Taking a short noodle-related break. I tried to recruit my mum for five minutes to help me, but that went down like a sack of shit. She just... Blurry pictures, wonky pictures, pictures where she's half stood in the light and it's half shadow. I just... I know I've got... I've got very high standards with this stuff, but... <sighs> fucking I have to redo all the pictures it's not worth it and then she's like oh please no because I just have to fucking redo it all I'm sorry sorry if that's mean but I've literally got to do it all again because none of the pictures are right if you've got really high standards just do it yourself just do it yourself because no one's gonna no one's gonna live up to your standards if you're like proper perfectionist um, it's really frustrating. Basically, I'm always going to have to do this myself because my standards are too high. And if anyone does it, I'll just get angry at them because they're doing it wrong. If you want something doing, do it yourself. That is the phrase that will always, always stand. I'm in a very dangerous mood now. I just feel that sort of, I just feel annoyed. It's annoyed me today. I didn't enjoy it. I'm in that mood where you start making up fucking... Your head goes off in a tangent. On a tangent, you start making up arguments and, and replying to yourself in your head because you, you're having this imaginary argument. Step too far, Jenna. Step too far. I need to take a step back, have a breathe, and stop arguing with no one because it, it's just stupid. I'm on my way to Jake's now, so hopefully... could go one or two ways. He could piss me off and it could all blow up, or... He could calm me down and then I could snap out of it. So hopefully Jake's in the right mood to handle me because I'm feeling irritable. I think I'm just a bit stressed at the minute. Yeah, I think it's been building up on the slide, of course. But yeah, I think I'm a little bit stressed. So I just go out into bed and cry. I'm okay. I'm just stressed. A lot of things are changing. Call of mine some chocolate. Why is it gone cold again? I thought it was starting to warm up with all that. Oh. Anyway, we're going to um, a pasta making class today, which Jake bought for me for my birthday. Uh, yeah, that'll be fun. We've made pasta before. I hope it's not fiddly business. I feel like it will be. I hope I'm not shit at it. And I hope we get to take our pasta home. I don't know. I don't even know what it's going to be like. And then afterwards, have we seen the place where they eat pasta out of a pizza bowl? I think we're going to go there. Like, when we watched the video of it, it sounded kind of appealing. I'm like, oh, that's cool. But now I think of it, I'm thinking it probably won't even be that nice. Like, do you need pizza in a pasta? Do you need pasta in a pizza bowl? I don't want it to just be like stodgy, angry, and gimmicky food. Yeah, so we're going to sit. We're going to have a nosy. If it's too full, because it's in Charlton, we'll just go to a Rudy's in Charlton. But then again, that might be booked. Um, I'm sure they can find a table for two. But yeah, that is where we're potentially going. I tried a new mascara today. The um, L'Oreal brown one. I've always wanted to try brown mascara. It's really nice. I think it looks that different from black, though. Um, but yeah, it's good. It's not rubbed under my eyes so far either. I've clamped 
bottom ones together so they look like individuals. Well, you know what I mean? They're like 60s, 50s slash. But yeah, I think it's a really good scar actually. I hope it's good. Jake wants it to like really be a little old lady because it says Nonna's past the class, which infers that it will be a little old lady, but I don't think it will. I don't think it will. I think just out, out here, walk out here. <sighs> yeah. My bet says that it's going to be a middle aged woman. She's not young, but she's not. She's able to communicate for her class. <laughs> Free plus glass of prosecco. That's enough for me. Yeah, free free glass of prosecco. Glass of prosecco on arrival. We aim to get around the Okay, we start with that. Now then, off you go. You can go. What's up? I thought we were from. I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> it feels nice. Oh, we're going to run it. It feels nice. Yeah, yeah, I'll do it. Paddy's up. being a show off. Man, shit. I can't do it. It looks like a willy. He's <laughs> a little shit. Doing it better than me. You can tell which one's mine. Or the shit ones. I think you need to show up. Yours look really good. We did Noki first, now we're doing something with an egg. I don't even know what we're doing next. I just know that it's got an egg. The first one was pasta and water. No, flour and water. Once you make lasagna, you if you have plenty of things. Well, I'm assuming you fold it over. <laughs> Funny. Jellyfish leg. We made it. I want them, look at that. I would really love to have them in my house. They're very expensive. So cool, I love it all. Oh, it's fun. I've got fucking flour and all sorts in my hair. Um, I feel like I know how to make pasta now, though. I've seen one of the machines. Definitely know how to make gnocchi. Um, I think it's... What's it called? It needs practice, but... Yeah, I feel... I Well, we'll wait and see until we've cooked it, but I feel confident that I could make my own, you know? I do. For the gnocchi, it was literally just flour and water. And then for the pasta, it was just flour and egg. Yeah. Uh, and then we bought some pasta as well. Oh, the other nice is plates, but they were so juicy for the gnocchi. I love them. Jake doesn't get it. He was like, yeah, I like them. The one underneath was a bit old lady though. That was my favourite one. It was like the one covered in lemons. Like proper Italian style, Sicilian. Um, but he didn't get that. He was like, it's like an old lady play. I was like, Jake, it's very on trend right now. Right, I think we're going to the place where you eat the pasta out of the pizza bowl. Jake wasn't too stuck on it. But yeah, I'm feeling pasta. We always go really. It's like we can't just do the same thing every day of our lives. Got to try somewhere new. It's busy. It's very, very busy. We've ended up in Rudy's because Jake didn't want to wait. Jake's impatient. So it wouldn't have been forty minutes. Literally, everyone was eating. It would have been finished. Soon. Jake's made a mistake. He's ordered a shy one, but I didn't. I didn't make that mistake. I ordered the same one I always get. Didn't go down too well. That one did it. Karma that for not waiting for the pasta blue. This is the pasta that we got. We got giant straws, like giant, and then we get yolks. And then this is our ravioli. It's got um some sort of filling, sun dried tomato, and was it ricotta? Uh, I don't. Did we both do the same one? In fact, we got to take some of the filling home, didn't we? We made some spaghetti. And we made some gnocchi. Ugh. Yeah, I know. Neither did I. It's probably much better with potato, though, isn't it? I reckon it's not hard to make. I mean, she kind of described it. Just boil the potatoes, peel them, and then add flour. Yeah. Nice, nice. 
Do you know what's giving me the most joy at the minute? The, what if, what animal even is it? The TikToks with, you know, the sad violin music and the, I'm literally just a girl. Is it a hamster? What is it? Oh, if you make my day. Me and Millie just send countless amounts of them to each other. They're just so funny. I definitely think some people will be really offended by that at some point. Like, this is so offensive to girls or this is so backwards. But I think... Well, first of all, shut up. But second, like, I... Obviously, as a girl... Believe that girls are sick. Like, we're not, like, incompetent or anything. Or, you know... Whatever message that is sending, I'm literally just a girl, as if we can't do things. But I just think it's all right. It's just all right to laugh at yourself, isn't it? I just think they're so funny. You know, I relate to them so much because there are so many things where I'm just like, oh, I'm just a girl. When in reality, yeah, I can do it absolutely fine, actually. But it's funny to laugh about the fact that I'm just a pathetic little girl and all I want to do is wear bows in my hair and watch TikToks. But I could do stinky real life jobs because I just relate to it so much. I saw someone, I don't even know if I'm just rambling shit now, but I saw someone complaining on one of the TikToks and I thought I knew this wouldn't be far off. So, yeah. But I just think, God, people are so afraid to just laugh at themselves. Like, it's a joke. It's a joke. Anyway, there's been a whirlwind of emotions this week, I think. Kind of mini whirlwind, like small tornado. But I think, I think, I think I've had a good week. I've had a monumental week. It's been an important week in my life. I think. Well, actually, we'll see what happens next week. We'll see if the house is confirmed or not, because that could change a lot of things. I think it is. I hope it is. We'll see. I hope everyone's had a nice week, and I will see you next week. Because I'm, I'm actually up to date with the vlogs now. So I actually will see you next week. I won't see you three months from now. Three months from now.